Thanksgiving is around the corner and families will be gathering to eat turkey. The rescue mission of the Mahoning Valley is helping families with the holiday tradition with a little help from some motorcycle riders. First News reporter Jacob Thompson has that story. Boxes filled with turkeys, canned food of all the fixings, and who can forget about the pie? I started this five years ago, called on all my brothers and sisters to help me out, and this is who comes out for me. It's the fifth Tony Bear Landis turkey trot. Motorcyclists met up and through donations headed to the grocery store. With the money raised, they get the food and head to the rescue mission in the Mahoning Valley. Like 88 turkeys last year. This year we did 150 turkeys and over a thousand, close to two thousand dollars worth of fixings. And we just thank God for their heart. We thank God for their passion, just like I told him. They don't love this. They are in love with this. The rescue mission serves hundreds of meals a day. The food donated to them will help feed those that come into the mission. So everything that they're donating today is going to be put into our food pantry to be able to serve three full meals to anyone in the community who needs it 365 days a year here. And even though it's called the Tony Bear Landis Turkey Trot, he couldn't do it without a little help from his friends. Met Bear from something I did, a charity that he came out and supported. And uh, when I heard about the turkey trot last year, I came out and so humbling. It's very rewarding. These, these people need a, need a little help, and especially around the holidays, and we can do what a little bit, little bit we do to help them out. This is what we love to do, man. We ride our bikes, and we love to give back to the community and help out. In Youngstown, Jacob Thompson, WKBN 27 First News. Hi everyone, I'm Lindsay Watson. Thanks for watching the WKBN 27 First News YouTube channel. If you want more video news, subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the WKBN 27 First News app for breaking news alerts.